of the current jelly brownies. Welcome back to the dessert show. I'm Debbie Fields. And now we're going to have a chance to make the jam and brandy plums. And since we're using plums in today's recipe, I thought it'd be interesting to note that did you know that there are more than 140 varieties of plums sold in the United States? Of the 140 varieties, most are either Japanese or European varieties. Uh, the Japanese plums are the juiciest and have yellow or, or red skin. And European plums are always um, kind of, they have like a blue skin or a purple skin. Okay, now here's the ingredients you're going to need to make this wonderful recipe. A quarter cup of red currant jelly, a quarter cup of red burgundy wine, one tablespoon of honey, half of one lemon, six canned plums, and brandy. Now let's get ready to make this. Right now, over the uh, stove top, I have the wine and the jelly cooking. And what that does, it, it makes it into a nice glaze. Then to that, I'm going to be adding the honey and getting that all mixed in. And of course, the juice of a lemon and setting it aside. And then of course, plums. Now you can use plums that are fresh or canned. If you use fresh ones, you just have to simmer them longer so that they get that wonderful flavor. But the goal here is just to make sure that we get the wonderful flavoring. And then, of course, the brandy. All of this is then added. Let it simmer for a bit. Take on the flavor. Set it aside. And then what we're going to do is we're going to place the plums on a serving tray. And then you're going to top with ice cream. Now, should you discover that you don't want to use wine or brandy, uh, then what basically I do is I use, uh, imitate, in this particular case, you can use rum flavorings or brandy, imitation brand, uh, brandy, or you can, instead of the wine, you can replace it with grape juice. All will work perfectly. This is what it looks like when it's done. It tastes great. It's real refreshing. It's very easy to make. Now, here's how you get all of the wonderful recipes for today's show. Be certain to write to me at the Dessert Show, care of TVFN. Post Office Box 4836, New York, New York, 10185. And please remember to enclose a self-addressed stamped envelope for show 3027. And just remember, what did we get a chance to make? Well, it was a jammin' show because it was full of jam tarts or our current jelly brownies. And then, of course, we ended with our jammin' brownie plums. Now, the key is, look at what we made. This was easy. This was uh, fast, and it really does have a nice, wonderful flavor. And then, oh, you've got to absolutely try these. These are so moist, they're so delicious, and they taste so great. You'll be a hero at home. Everyone will think that you spent hours in the kitchen. And then, oh, yes, the jam tart. It was so great. It's so easy to make. And you know what? I'm looking forward to seeing you tomorrow. I had a great day with you. Take care. Until then. Guests and staff of the Dessert Show stay at the Clubhouse Inn, Nashville, just minutes away from Opryland. Complimentary breakfast and evening receptions make you feel at home. Call 1-800-CLUB-IN. The Dessert Show is a Reedland production.